many people just like you have asked the question, am I a healer or do I have healing gifts that I may not be aware of? I thought it would be fun to put together this fun little quiz, 24 questions, true and false, to see if any of these precursors or indications or foreshadowings may be in your energy field with respect to your healing path. Now, of course, I do believe we are all here to heal one another and to help us to remember the deeper part of ourselves, which is love. And so as we do our own healing work for ourselves through our various experiences, just by living life, that healing also transfers out to others. But then there are those who feel directly called, such as myself, to do healing work with individuals on an emotional, mental, spiritual, and physical level. So I wonder if you are one of them. Go ahead and get a pen and paper, write down the numbers 1 to 24, put true and false, and write down with each slide what it is that you resonate with. And at the end, we'll tally up your points to answer the question, could you quite possibly be a healer in the waiting room? I tend to be very empathetic, feel deep emotions or physical sensations as I engage in interacting with others. So many people, and at times even strangers, tend to confide in me with their problems. Take a number. I sometimes feel things so deeply that I tend to take on other people's emotions, which can sometimes cause me some anxiety or cause me to feel heavy. I think I need a weight loss program. I tend to know some natural solutions to people's dilemmas and make their lives better, however, oftentimes neglecting my own emotional needs. I feel drawn to counseling, massage therapy, Reiki, chiropractic, physical therapy, or any other service-oriented profession. There's a history of healers in my family, and I think I might be one of them. I tend to be very intuitive, with a heightened sense of awareness about situations or people, seeing or sensing beyond what most others do not. Sometimes I tend to take on too much. I have a difficult time saying no to people. I might need to take a class on saying no. People tend to turn to me to help solve issues they are having. Sometimes I can feel dumped on or sometimes overwhelmed because of it. Sometimes, honestly, I feel like a trash can. I tend to feel drained after I've been in large gatherings or crowds for a short or extended period of time. Small children and all kinds of furry, feathery animals tend to be drawn to me. Sometimes I think that even a porcupine would cuddle up to me. Complete strangers tend to share their life stories with me. Even if I stand still for too long, they seem to gravitate to me with great interest and hang on every word. I've been known to be very accommodating with guests that never want to leave. I tend to have digestive issues, neck or shoulder pains with headaches. Random aches and pains may show up for no apparent reason. People tend to treat me like their personal oracle, seeking advice on things like relationships, family, jobs, or life-changing events. I have often felt connected with nature and everything around me. I feel like a magnet. I tend to gravitate toward natural healing methods like plant-based medicines and Eastern healing modalities, feeling intuitively that the body knows how to heal itself. I tend to be attracted toward rocks and crystals or anything out of the ordinary. I can totally rock that. I have felt a buzzing or vibration sensation within my body that seems to come out of nowhere. 
I tend to love to listen to or read literature that focuses on healing work, spirituality, science, the odd, unexplained, or supernatural. I consider myself spiritual and seem to be connected to something supernatural that I may or may not be able to explain to people, but maybe to aliens. I seem to know things that most other people may not, having keen insight or unexplained wisdom beyond my human experience or years. I've gone through some tremendous hardships in life that seem to be more than most. I could probably write a bestseller on suspense, drama, or even a thriller. I seem to be able to tap into other people's lives and even see into the future. I'm really thinking about investing in a crystal ball. I have often felt like a stranger here, feeling different or peculiar somehow, with my personal interests different than most of my friends. Is your healing path calling you out? So go ahead and count your total of the 24 questions and it may give you an indication of whether the healing path is calling you.